she treats the guinea pigs like her puppies. You cannot go in the guinea pig cage. You are too big. She cleans them. She watches them while they're playing. Nisha, good morning. Every morning when we wake up, she immediately hops out of bed to go in and check on them. Straight to the pigs. Okay, yeah. That's cool. They're the calmest with Misha out of all of us. They will eat when she's around because that's a big sign of comfort is if they continue to eat while someone's around them. She pretty much doesn't leave their side when we're not home. She knows exactly where they are the whole time. If they go up a level, she stands up with them. And if they're down the level, she lays down so she can see them completely. Hey, where are your piggies? One time I had to move the cage because I was cleaning and when I let her back in, she just went into full mother meltdown mode thinking her babies were missing. Do you think they're in one of these rooms? Which one? No. You found them! <laughs> if the guinea pigs go anywhere, Misha will take herself into that room. She is extremely protective of them. She'll be right there whenever the cat is near the guinea pig, just watching her, just to make sure. Was she watching your guinea pigs? Yes. <gasps> Did you keep them safe? Yes. Are they your babies? <coughs> Misha, what is it? What did we get? From the second we brought the guinea pigs home, she was smitten and was just immediately enchanted by the guinea pigs. We had a very, very slow introduction, much to Misha's disgust. At the start, she was only allowed to be with them when they were being held and when there was a barrier up. Slowly but surely, once a guinea pig started to relax around her, we took away that barrier and let her just slowly be introduced to them. <laughs> Stay. She was just so excited to be so close to them. I'm always there watching because she's so big. When we're out in public, Misha can be treated quite differently to other dogs around her. Did you get all excited to see someone and then they cross the road? Unfortunately, get lots of stares. We get people unfortunately crossing the road when we walk near them. What is she doing to you? Honestly, she hasn't got a nasty bone in her body. She's just our big gentle giant. I truly think she thinks she got to have her puppies.